Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. It's about six in the morning. I can barely keep my eyes open. Probably shouldn't be staring into the sun anyway. Uh, I'm out. You're up. Sorry. I'm I up. didn't mean to wake you up. It was me who woke you up. Was it nature who woke you up? Because I'll, I'll go and talk to Mother Nature about that. Sorry. It wasn't me, was it? No. You were very quiet. Yeah, I was. <laughs> Huh. It feels so good to be able to, you know, be myself again now that you're awake. Thank you. Thank you so much. This is very freeing for me. Chris is in there live streaming. And I've been pukey this morning. I've already thrown up twice. So I'm hoping that's it. I even have my puke bucket. Remember that? Just in case. Ugh, and my head is killing me. It's just one of those days, you know? I washed these covers last night, and I just realized Wicket was laying inside a dryer sheet. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Come back. Well, that was one fine array of announcements. Don't you just love the smell of new software? Where? There. Where? Isn't that new? No. Oh. Don't you love the new smell of old software? You puked grape juice. Did you drink grape juice? Yes. Okay. We're fine. No need to rush to the emergency room or call 911. Why did I have to put my cap on when my hair was still wet? Now it's all in a weird position. You should have worn it out. Worn what out? We're about to go out. Yeah, I know, but I don't... Well, I guess I could wear the hat if you want me to wear the hat. This is a slightly different hat, but... You can't wear hat. that hat. Why? It's not the occasion hat. I feel so drained all of a sudden. Diana went and stood in the driveway, and it's sunny out, and I think I got too much vitamin D. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? Mm, I need to moderate my intake. Yeah, too much at once. You can OD. Any at all. <laughs> you smell like coffee. It smells good. Yeah, well, it took me a while to get my coffee because the guy in front of me was a little older and he was asking about every item on the menu and every variation of every item on the menu. He didn't know what to get? No, he didn't know what they had and he ultimately went with a large coffee. <laughs> Could have saved him a lot of time. I almost bought the coffee for him. I said, hey, just, I, whatever you just, first word come out of your mouth, I will buy it. Maybe it was his first time in there. That's my thinking. And it's a relatively popular store to go to to get coffee, so that doesn't make a lot of sense. Well, remember my mom's first time was here. But your mom's very smart. Yeah, sometimes it helps when you know kind of what you want. Like, I want something that tastes chocolatey, but... Not coffee -y, you know? That's what I like. I'm just the opposite. <laughs> something that doesn't taste like coffee. <laughs> no, something that does taste like coffee and not like chocolate. I know. Unless it's dark chocolate. Love that. <gasps> they had drinking chocolate at one time. I think it still exists. Sipping chocolate. We had it! Mm -hmm. At the farmer's market, like, years ago. We weren't even vlogging at the time. That was good stuff. It was really good. Drinking chocolate. 
Just gonna try to plow through the leftovers we have. Leftovers. I don't have any leftovers. leftovers. Dude, yeah. there's tons of leftovers at home. No, Swear to God. All yours. Pasta? How's pasta mine? Just because I'm Italian. That's racist. <laughs> and burrito. That's Mexican. If anything, it's yours. We have burrito? Oh, yeah, you have your burrito. The arm burrito you keep forgetting about. <laughs> it's yours. Yeah, but it's still a burrito. It's more Mexican than it is Italian. You're more Mexican than you are Italian. You're not Italian. You're Mexican in blood and heritage. If I cut open your veins, salsa would pour out. <laughs> that sounds painful. It does. So let's not go that route. I'd rather not go that far to prove my point. And if I cut open your veins, marinara sauce will pour out. Yeah. You couldn't think of the word. No, I was gonna say olive oil. Oh, ooh, yeah, I like that more. Yeah, let's try. <laughs> I'm gonna drop them. <laughs> you need help? Hold on. I got you covered. There we go. Got it. Uh oh. This is kind of hard for me. I don't know if it's Baby's first toy, but one of their first stuffed animals, or stuffed Wookiee, from Chris Conquest who's hoping to be a patron soon. Well, thank you for this, and I'm sure Baby Perilla will enjoy it as well. I will also enjoy the Darth Vader popcorn bucket, though it did not come with popcorn, uh, whoever sent this, and whoever sent this fitted sheet for a crib that is also water resistance. And Diana reminds me that it's going to have to be that way because the baby apparently leaks. And one of Diana's famous recipes is in a cookbook. It's Diana's recipe for Jabba Slobber Salsa, although they only credited me and my name and my face. You're my wife? She's the one who deserves all the credit. I, I don't know. I, all I did was eat it. I'm guessing that whatever's in here is cute. Hmm. Goo goo. And I pooed. Thank you, Andy and Tracy Barthorpe from the UK. They found geeky baby things for us. That's cute. I think I'll be using the mute button frequently. <laughs> Is it okay to start the laundry now? It's always time to start the laundry. <laughs> I had to put it off because Chris was recording. I love that sound because it's the sound of getting clean underwear at some point in the near future. Could use some clean underwear. Oh, hi, you're vlogging. I'd love it too if I didn't have to do it. Uh, we can train Wicket. <laughs> Just kidding. All right. Bulky? Was that a, was that a slam on my kind of clothes? <laughs> I don't really appreciate your tone there. It says bulky large. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I found this thing that looks like a spider. I'm going to put it in Chris's office. Right there. I was trying to scare you. Glad you didn't. And it backfired. <laughs> you just ate that piece of string. Well, his poop will be easier to pick up. The family that naps together, slaps together. What? That's his poop end. We're waiting on laundry to finish. That might be a while. And I'm not sure if the laundry is going to jump up and put itself into the washer. There's laundry in the washer and the dryer. Both? Can you do that? Okay. Out. He does that. I know, because he doesn't have any teeth to hold it in. <laughs> He's got some teeth, he just doesn't have any teeth on the top of his snout. He's missing his two front teeth. That's all he wants for Christmas. See? Yeah. Oh, you poor thing. <laughs> Wait, you have hot sauce right there. <laughs> Did she get hot sauce? Uh, yeah, I was going to ask you how he got hot sauce there. <laughs> or maybe he's ketchup. <laughs> okay, wait a second. You're not sure whether he's got hot sauce or ketchup? What have you been eating today? No, that's not from today. 
Oh God, how long has our dog had hot sauce or ketchup on his snout? Oh, it's so clean. See, in his mouth. <laughs> I feel kind of funny eating something called Smart Popcorn. That's the label, not necessarily the brand. I mean, why is it smart? Does it have like a central nervous system? Feelings? That's a little creepy. Snacks that can think. Hey, hon. I was just thinking about things I probably shouldn't be thinking about. Where's your sister? I think I've seen your tongue more than I've seen Pixie. I know you love me because you take the time to pick out all the seeds. Yes. Including all the small white ones. That's right. That took me over four hours. Damn. Thanks again for liking, commenting, subscribing, sharing, becoming a patron, watching even more of our videos right now, after visiting a YouTube page of ours, clicking the gear icon next to a subscribe button there, and enabling updates.